Okay, so my winch here is uh, just your Harbor Freight 400 pound winch or something like that. Uh, this is a homemade one we built. I think this is the 11th season on it. And my one vice grip's about wore out, so this summer I'm going to have to pressure wash this thing off real good and weld new vice grips on it. Instead of drilling into my concrete, I took a, a 15 gallon sanitizer barrel and poured. Uh, it was either two or three sacks of sackcrete in it, concrete. Then we just concrete anchored this right into it. That way I can move it at the end of the season and take a hose in here and wash everything out. So with that, you just, you just when you set the con put the concrete in there, you just put that in there to be, and it's just held by just the concrete? Well, we used uh, concrete anchor bolts. Oh, okay. We drilled it after. It's got all that crud built up on it from this season. But, or, uh, concrete anchored the, the mount in. And then another thing I added that is really handy, this is a magnetic strip. So as I'm skinning and working, I can set my knife over there when I need to use both hands and it keeps all my tools here. I got a metal tail stripper I'll throw up there. And just stuff to help speed you along. What about your sit here? Uh, I got it, I doubled up the joists up top just got a heavy piece of cable and it's hanging right off of that that way everything's down here by me my controller and everything and i got a piece of wire that keeps my controller held out it'll actually bend out when i'm doing a lot of coons keep it where it's easier to grab but don't swing it out in front of your garage door otherwise you'll pull in here and smack your mirror with it <laughs> works good it's done a lot of fur Yeah, because well, I, I put this in the first year we bought this place, this house, and uh, I didn't really know how I wanted everything set up. So this way it's pretty easy to move, and if I ever want to change anything, I don't have holes in my floor.